The other reason why we're here today, um, other than checking out the kitchen top side, is um, I had an idea of where we can put our uh, fermentation uh, glycol chiller, which is just a big HVAC unit. Keeps all the fermenters serving and bright tanks cold. Um, what I'd like to do is from a patron that comes in, he recommended uh, this place will need a little bit of heat in the winter. So if we can have it venting out waste heat into this space, but then in the summer, it can divert outside. Um, our outdoor space is gonna be here, so we can't be venting things on the patrons. Um, so what I'm thinking, this is the very far corner of the brewery. We will be putting our uh, roll-up garage door to get stuff in and out here on, on a big concrete pad. If we just put a little concrete pad or something right here in this corner, It'll be up above uh, the parking lot grade. We could put our HVAC unit there and uh, we could vent it out in the winter time or, or in the summertime when we don't want the hot air inside. We can vent it directly out and then just uh, for the winter time, just shut it off and it'll uh, helpfully uh, heat the inside a little bit. Now the second reason why we're down here is, uh, remember the tap rooms I'm going to be up here. These uh, block walls are going to disappear. We're going to put a 12 foot mezzanine. Um, but with the kitchen, the uh, wastewater treatment plant, they've got a fog program, fats, oils, and greases. Um, instead of fooling with grease traps that need checked weekly and pumped out monthly, um, there's also another option where I can put a uh, thousand gallon plastic tank. And if I can get it, right now we're going under the tap room area. And this part goes right outside to the side of the building. So, you will see behind me, the tap room is right above here. So, all the plumbing can come down here. And if we can have the grease trap, or this big thousand gallon uh, holding tank for grease. Right around here, now that goes directly to the outside of the building, and we can have somebody come in and pump it out on like a you know, three to four month basis, which could help a lot. Um, so I'm just evaluating the space for that because there's a ton of space. So I'm um, making progress, it's slow.